the dark. Hold on. Adjust my thing light a little bit. That's better. That's better. Hello, everybody. Hello, hello, hello. And I'm back. I'm still a little dark. Hold on. Let me adjust camera settings. Hold on. Um, too much da -da -da. Da -da. there we go that's about that's about where i like it okay i'm also this mm, adjusting that sorry i did a pre-check but my i must have bumped my camera without realizing it since yeah good enough um but, uh, hey everybody, how are y'all doing? I know it's been a whole ass week, well, a little bit more than a week, actually, uh, since I was last here. I'm sorry, but I needed to take last week off. Uh, no real reason, um, I just, Sunday, l last Sunday, I was thinking about it, I'm like, I need a fucking break. So I took a fucking break. Um, but, uh, oops. Sorry, my ring light's about to fall over. Uh, no. Adjust yourself. There we go. Save the ring light. Save the ring light. Save the world. There we go. Uh. But yes, last week I had to take it off because I needed a break. Um, I really needed a break. Um, and then shit kind of hit the fan for me emotionally last week. Um. Ring light, stop that. Do not be the problem child today. You're gonna be the problem child today. Hold on. One moment, please. Ah, come on. There we go. For now. There's a short in the cord, I've discovered. Or at least I've decided that there's a short in the cord. It's the only thing that really makes sense. Um, anyway. Anyway. Uh, yeah, last week was a bit of an emotional problem for me. Uh, that's not why I took off. It just happened to be that week. And I'm kind of glad it was that week. Because trying to stream while struggling with your own mental health is not easy. So anyway... I'm good now. I'm much better now. And I'm glad to be back. I missed streaming. Um, but, you know, even if you miss it, you still need a break every now and then, right? But yeah, I missed y'all. I missed the streams. I missed the games. Well, I didn't miss the games. I played the games. I didn't play these games, but I played... The, I played... I played Halo. Uh, I played a lot of Halo last week, actually. Um, not Halo Infinite. Um, I was going to, but than the new Yu-Gi-Oh! Master Duel or whatever it is, uh, completely distracted me. Um, I, I have the Master Chief Collection, the Halo Master Chief Collection on Steam, and I have not played, because I don't have an Xbox, and I've never had an Xbox, I've only really ever been able to play the PC versions of, of the Halo games, unless I was over at a friend's house. Um, and when I was at a friend's house, they only ever wanted to play multiplayer, which is fair. Uh, I mean, like, multiplayer versus stuff, so that they could wreck my shit, because I'd, I did not have the ability to play the games, and I was not used to the controller. Um, but it's fair. It's fine. It's fair. It's it's good. But the, uh, I'm not salty. I'm not. I'm not salty. Uh, my friends always put up with my bullshit, and I, I love them for it. But, uh, anyway, the, um, <clears throat> the, uh... So because of that, I never really knew the storyline beyond Halo One, Halos 1 and 2, because those were the two that came out on Windows back in the day. Um, and so 3, 4, etc., I had no real knowledge of. I mean, I knew the lore because Reach, ODST, I, I knew the lore, I knew the basic storylines because I loved the, the universe, the fictional, the fictional universe and the lore but I'd never actually experienced it, you know? 
Um, and so when I when I when Master Chief Collection was released on PC a year or so ago, I left at the chance, and I waited for it to be on sale because I'm poor, uh, and money is a thing. Um, but it's uh, I I. Oh, I'm so glad I did. Um, I'm sad that they only have Halos 1 through 4, plus ODST and Reach. I wi I hope that someday they add Halo 5, uh, even though I don't think they will. Uh, they've said that there's no will, uh, no no uh, in, um, intention to at this point, which is fair, but still sad. Um, I have not gotten the, con uh, the uh, campaign for Halo Infinite because I have not played Halo 5. Uh, Halo 5 is the one I actually know the least about. Um, but I finished. I I had uh, play. I'd been putting off playing Halo Four uh, on Master Chief Collection until I don't remember why. It was the one that I was the least familiar with out of the Master Chief Collection, because I had played Reach and ODST at some friends' houses. Hadn't played the story mode really, but I was familiar with them. I was more familiar with them than I was four. Um, and so I was putting it off. Oh, I know why I was putting it off. I was putting it, I, I was putting it off until I could actually dedicate the, the attention and the time to it to play it with nothing else going on. Uh, because I wanted to give it that kind, you know, it's one of those, the Halo games for me uh, and the Assassin's Creed games are one of those things where my first time playing it through, I kind of want to give it my undivided attention. Um, and I, I want to do that with almost every game I play. Uh, that way I can it, it has my full attention now unless if I'm multi oops, excuse me um, if I'm playing it a, mul a second time through or another time through then I'm more likely that then I'm then I'm more willing to like multitask and stuff like that but uh, which is one of the reasons why uh, I'm a little hesitant to play games I haven't played on stream though I have not had much of a focus issue uh, with those games yet so that's good anyway um but yeah so i played halo 4 this last week beat it oh i loved it i know that uh four and five uh that some of the halo games and i think that includes four and five are a little controversial for the halo fandom and that's okay you know you guys have your own opinions on things just like i have my own opinions on things but i loved four um I loved 4. 4 was great. I, I really enjoyed the storyline. I cried at the end. Um, not like sobbing, but like I teared up, you know, because I I am emotionally invested in the characters, even though I do admit that there are some problematic aspects to many aspects of the Halo series. But like with Assassin's Creed, there's problematic aspects to the series but I still enjoy it and I get invested in the characters and the storyline because they're good games, you know, and they're good stories, even though there are problematic aspects like them, like them retroactively forcing a Native American into the, <laughs> the Boston Tea Party. <laughs> uh, uh, anyway, uh, uh anyway yeah <laughs> but yeah so i played halo 4 um i've been really enjoying it i, I really enjoyed it i want to get i want to take the time at some point to get into the multiplayers because i do love the halo multiplayers and I, like i said i love halo um but priorities you know my priorities are the stream and these games for the stream because I love you guys and I want to share my favorite games with you as well as the experiences of ga other games and the like. So maybe we'll get to Halo someday. Who knows? We'll see. Um, I don't, I haven't planned that far ahead. Um, but, uh, but, uh, I forget where I was going with that. Oh yeah, I'd also been. I've also been. I'm a. I'm a. I'm a nerd. I'm a heckin' nerd. If you couldn't tell by the background and you know me, uh, you know, 
Yeah. The, <laughs> if you couldn't tell, I'm a hecking nerd. Um, <clears throat> I've also been enjoying the Yu-Gi-Oh, the new Yu-Gi-Oh game that came out, the Master Duel for free. It's where you basically just play Yu-Gi-Oh online, and I love it. Um, kind, it's kind of like how, like things that they've done with Gwent and Magic, the uh, Magic the Gathering's Arena, um, game and things like that. It's kind of like that, um, but it's Yu-Gi-Oh, and I love it. Um. I've been really enjoying it. It's a good game for me to just have going in the background while I'm doing a thousand other things at once. Um, so maybe one day I'll, uh, maybe someday I'll, I'll be doing some of that on stream if I need to, like on a Friday or something if I want to stream, but just want to kind of chill or do something else. Um, but, uh, yeah, anyway, enough of my bullshit. Uh, announcements. Um... This weekend is D&D weekend, uh, to my knowledge. Um, unless something comes up, we will be having D&D over on Yvonne B's channel um, at the usual times. Uh, Etc. Um, sorry, I was distracted by a uh, bug bite on my hand that I didn't remember having before. Um, then let's see what else oh 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 uh next tuesday march the first march first tuesday march first the first of march that is a tuesday <laughs> uh will not be a stream day the re I, I might slip up and say see you all tomorrow or something like that next week um because i do that sometimes but i'm saying it now and i'm going to try to remember to say it every day from now on basically until then uh i will not be home i've got errands i need to run and shit i need to do on that day like it has to be that day stuff um so i will not be able to stream that day rest of the week should be fine but march 1st tuesday tuesday march 1st march 1st that is a tuesday the first of march <laughs> which is a tuesday <laughs> there will be no stream and I will try my best to remember to say that. Um, there will be a stream tomorrow. Tomorrow is not March 1st. Tomorrow is February 22nd. <laughs> I had to check. <laughs> and then I had to thought of, think about it. Uh, but there will be a stream tomorrow, just not next week. Okay? Okay. Also, my friend Cosplay Katie got me this. I'm not sponsored by Spar Starbucks or by whoever made this, but she got me this and it's great and i love it let me get a little close up i love my friend anyway hmm. hydrate and Ooh. <clears throat> Sorry, I have not really taken the time to stretch today, which is bad. Oh, God, I needed that. Let's get into this. All righty. I need to... Ooh, hold on. Let me make a note for myself uh, so I don't forget. Real quick. Oh, nope. That's not... Hmm. Um... Hmm. That needs to stay. Let me let me put the note over here. Uh, uh what was it? Uh, okay. Sorry, I just had an idea about something that I might want that I want to try for my stream. And then I don't want to forget about it. Okay, so where were we? Connor has stopped John Pitcairn, and the American Revolution has begun in earnest. The Templars have turned their attention to George Washington, who they planned to assassinate, and we were trying to stop them. And with that, we ended up in prison. Up, up with you. I said get up.
I wonder why they don't have footsteps here. Oh, maybe they just want to feel the ambiance of it. I don't remember if the original had footsteps or if it's supposed to have footsteps. It might have. I don't know. Yeah. Anyway. Hello, Connor. Didn't think I'd miss your going away party, did ya? <laughs> I hear Washington himself is gonna be in attendance. Hope nothing bad happens to him. You said there'd be a trial. Oh, no trial for traitors, I'm afraid. Lee and Haytham saw to that. It's straight to the gallows for you. <laughs> I will not die today. The same cannot be said for you. Oh, I love Connor. I love Connor so much. I will not die today. The same cannot be said for you. There's George, good old GW. Oh. There was a, there was a shank sound. Oh, hello up there, friend. Up there in the top, uh, top corner, top left. So my, my buddies are clear in the herd. girl oh Achilles you are not alone we will give a cry when you need us forget about me you need to stop Hickey he's uh, up you go don't want to be late now do we you just had to be an hero didn't you you and Georgie both now you see what it gets you a pine box and little help Brothers, sisters, fellow patriots. Several days ago, we learned of a scheme so vile, so dastardly, that even repeating it now disturbs my being. The man before you plotted to murder our much beloved general. Indeed. Background. What dastard or madness? <laughs> or the ragdoll. And he himself <laughs> offers no defense, shows no remorse. And though we have begged and pleaded with him to share what he knows, he maintains a deadly silence. If the man will not explain himself, if he will not confess and atone, what other option do we have but this? He sought to send us into the arms of the enemy. And thus we are compelled by justice to send him from this world. May God have mercy on yourself. Please disturb Hickey. Go. Oops. Oops. 
Yeah, I just full on failed. Yeah, okay. Damn it. Yeah, I'm going to let him kill. Cuz I really want to get this 100%. I really do. I have to kill two militia and uh kill hickey before he can kill the bodyguards damn it the slow motion is such a pain in the ass and there goes the bodyguards Nope. Fucking people. Eh, let him. What the hell is... Let me... Fucking... Okay. I need to get to him, slow him down so he doesn't get to the fucking... Oh, can we not be running in slow motion, please? Nope, 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 nope. Come on. Ow. Wait, what? Damn it. I thought I'd at least live to see another day. It's a shame. I want answers. Why did Johnson try and buy my people's land? Why was Pitcairn targeting Adams and Hancock? What purpose would Washington's murder have served? Why does your order support the British? How should I know? The Templars, Lee, Big man, Haytham. They had the money. They had the power. That's the reason I threw him at them. That's the only reason. He's Surely not a uh... vision for the future too. I didn't give a damn about any of that. I yep. can sing their songs about mankind and its troubles. They can make their plans and spring their traps. Don't bother me none. They paid me, so I said yes. Didn't bother to ask who, or how, or why. 
didn't care. You chose to side with men who would rob us of our humanity simply because it was more profitable. What else is yes. there? Yes. I'm not some blind fool who give up all I've got on principle. What is principle anyway? Can you bring it to the bank? Fuck capitalism. Don't look at me like that. We're different, you and I. You're just some blind fool who's always chasing butterflies. Whereas I'm the type of guy who likes to have a beer in one hand and a tea in the other. Thing is, boy, I can have what I seek. Had it even. You. Your hands will always be empty. Yeah, things have kind of glitched a little bit. Hero can be so stubborn sometimes. Piffle, he said, when we warned him something like this would happen. Piffle. Stop. He wanted to kill that man. Nearly killed you as well. He was a scoundrel. But still a man. <clears throat> You're nothing if not consistent. Where is Washington? I need to speak with him. Bundled off as soon as your execution went sideways. He's likely on his way back to Philadelphia by now. And so am I. Something wrong? He is still in danger. Hickey did not act alone. I'm gonna end up having to do that again, probably. Yep. Damn. I wasn't able to do any of the 100%ing that I usually do in between streams last week because we were in the middle of a section that I could not exit. It's quite impressive what you've accomplished. Is that a compliment? Well, don't misconstrue. I'm sure the whole endeavor will end tragically. But we've come this far, well, it's more than I ever expected. The people yearned for freedom, but feared to grab hold of it. That fear is gone now. Thanks to you? No. This they did on their own. Your cane is really short, Achilles. I do what is right. No more, no less. You cannot tell him. I have to. Otherwise, he will never be safe. He is safer not knowing. By planting the seeds of doubt, he threatened to topple his entire endeavor. If Washington is paralyzed, Charles Lee will strike. You'll cause the very thing you aim to prevent. Hunt the Templars, as is your duty. But do not drag these men into it. We must now all hang together. Yes, we must indeed all hang together. Or most assuredly, we shall all hang separately. You are once more our savior. I must speak with the commander. He's gone to try and hold New York. The British intend to take it. I fear we'll need to recall our men from Quebec as well. It's one thing to declare our independence. Now, my friend, we must make it so. Batman. Everything all right? Sean has located a second power source. I've asked Rebecca to charter a flight for us. Where to? Brazil. Who? In time for a uh, carnival. Ooh, wanted posters of Desmond.
Glad to see that's working. Guess I'll try you back when I'm topside. Sir, are you okay? Oh, hello. Big ol' wanted poster of my face. Yay. Sorry, it was the wrong button. Brazil. I wonder what city in Brazil. Look at that. That's not right. <laughs> the textures just glitched the fuck out. Copy now. Yeah, I don't want to steal somebody's ticket to a to a football. That doesn't look like normal security. Yeah, whoa. Something more important than a than a game going on, guys? Nope, 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 nope. Okay, they're turned around now. Don't mind me. Carry on. You two are having a good time. Your target's definitely in the VIP area. The entrance is at the end of this concourse. You are the only Tell me if the video is immediatamente stupid. Can I blend in with you guys? No? I'm about to be seen. Estamos procurando este hombre y ver algo suspecto. Sale con agente inmediatamente. There's got to be a way to slip past him. Side room, maybe? Hallway? Something? Can I, can I talk to you guys? No? Yes. Okay. Okay. So, something I'm noticing is that it doesn't show the normal hiding in the crowd outline that it does in uh well it might over here it's because these ones are glowing yeah see that normally if i was in the animus it would kind of like glow up a little bit and make it more obvious that i'm in that i'm hiding it's clever it's clever because this is outside of the animus Nope. Nope, that would not be good. Great. Set up a checkpoint. Hey, 
okay? Seriously, what is the deal with stadiums and piss troughs? Disgusting. Who thought they were a good idea? I don't even see a stall in here. I see stalls. Yeah, please just mute the microphone if you do. Are they? Looks like I'm close. Shit. Another checkpoint. Oops, wrong button. Sorry, Desmond. Other side. Okay, so there's a roaming guard. I love that they're indicating the guards by the guards having glow sticks on them or something. Hey guys, what's up? How you doing? Having a good time? Hey friends, how y'all doing? Y'all having a good time? Pardon me, sir. Come in, can I come in? Sorry. What's in here? Oh, sorry. Hey y'all, don't mind me just coming through. Don't tell me you're suddenly afraid of heights. You gotta cross these really close now. Oh shoot, this is not a football game, this is a boxing match. Shit, okay. Uh let's see here. I think this is the way I need to go. Hey guys, don't mind me. Enjoying the match? What the fuck? Come here, Cross. Or whoever the fuck you are.
You missed, man. Okay, so that wasn't cross. It was some random guy. We can get back to Connor whenever you're ready, Jensen. Unless you want to plug in the power source thing. Up to Which you. I do. I do. But first, I want to talk to you guys. How are you so, doing, Rebecca? What's the latest? Learn anything <clears throat> interesting while you're exploring? We were working on some weird stuff towards the end. We're trying to engineer new bodies, store their minds inside computers. Failure after failure. It must have been hard for them. Don't worry about it, too. I mean, they say there's something in here that'll help us. But what is it? Why is it locked up if it's exactly what we need? I don't know. Maybe it's dangerous. <coughs> Maybe they wanted to make sure only you could reach it. That's the other question. What makes me so special? I guess you'll know once we open the door. Hey, I hope it's not uncomfortable for me to ask, but what happened with Lucy? I don't know. I'm sorry, I shouldn't have said anything. No, it's fine. I really don't know. I was talking to my dad about it. It's, it's hard to say. I mean, Juno definitely took control, but I think I agreed to it on some level. I think I let her in. No. <laughs> That's not right. It, it wasn't her. Not exactly. It, it was more like a, a program. That sound weird? It showed me things. What'd you see? That if I didn't stop Lucy, that Sturka would get the apple, and we'd all be dead. I still don't understand why she turned on us. I'm sure she thought she was doing the right thing. I gotta get back to work. You might want to do the same. Sorry, Desmond. A little busy right now. Alrighty. Hey, good old dad, where'd you go? There you are. What's up, dad? Where are you going? Can I talk to you? I want to talk to you. Got anything to say to me? No? Apparently not. Nothing to say to me? No? Okay, fine. I'll go talk to Sean. Maybe he'll say something to me. <clears throat> Shawnee. Good old Shawnee. How you doing, Sean? What's up? Uh, uh, unbelievable. What's up? Your politicians are constantly referencing the Founding Fathers. Insisting they must have been in support of one thing or another and have never seen such a blatant disregard for history. That's just typical political propaganda. It's also dishonest. <laughs> There's an ad starting in about seven and a half minutes. How could anyone claim to know what these people wanted based off scraps of paper and wishful thinking? They're looking for intent. What these men envisioned for our country and its future. Idealistic and unlikely. I don't think most of your presidents and senators and judges care what the founders thought. Nope, they, they don't. They can bend old words to achieve modern goals. Yeah. Who cares if they were deists or theists or wanted a central bank? Why do people need the validation? What should matter is what you, as an individual, believe and why you believe it. What, are we 
so insecure that we have to find 18th century letters to validate our beliefs. Oh, look, Mum, a dead man agreed with me. Maybe. If you transpose the letters in his shopping list, you can plainly see he was on my side. Jesus, Sean. It's a cynical way to look at it. But, but also true. true. I keep trying to understand how men like Washington and Jefferson could dedicate their lives to the pursuit of liberty and equality, yet have no problem owning slaves. Hypocritical in the extreme. And your history books make only passing mention of the subject, as if, as if it were of little consequence. They had a war to win. The country's future to secure. How could they deal with all these issues at the same time? Spoken like a true apologist. We hear it today, too, that matters of civil rights and equality must wait. There are conflicts to settle, economies to salvage. What do any of these things matter if the people are not free and equal? All of them. Absolutely. I wish there was a way for us to share what we learned from the animus with others. Imagine being able to accurately answer questions about the past or experience lost civilizations. But how would you cite it? We can't just reveal the machine's existence to the world. Why not? Desmond's right. It would be dangerous. And we still haven't found a way to manage the bleeding effect. Maybe when we're done saving the world, we can look into it. Even if we do manage to stave off the apocalypse, it's not like the Templars are simply going to disappear. I suspect our fight will continue long after this latest battle is finished. Oh, look at the time. What doesn't time fly? Look, I think it's best we get you back in the office, no? Oh, and Chop Chop, we need to find that key, Desmond. It's not going to happen with you out here, is it? Yeah, unfortunately. Hey, Dad, will you talk to me now? Good old John DeLancey. No? Okay. All right, let's go, um... Let's go put this... Go plug this thing in. We've been up here before. Oh, no, nope, it's up there. Oh, but blind. Okay, over here. Come on, Desmond. Oh, no, Desmond. Ad starting in three minutes and 45 seconds. Up, please. Desmond. There we go. Had to get the angle just right. Okay, this took me back here. Um. I'm trying to remember. Down here? Yes, here we go.
How did she have that as a bracelet? next console and the way up to it all right let's pause that real quick because i have to check something on discord All right, Juno's over there waiting for us. Um, hey, look, lights. Novel. You, there's something down here. Don't be dumb. I don't know. Maybe they were sleeping or something and you woke them. Some kind of cryogenics or hibernation. I mean, how do we know what the hell they were doing down here? They were working on a bunch of different solutions, but nothing worked. It just went from one to the next, and then I don't know. They must have left at some point. After the end. I wonder what the world would be like if they'd succeeded. I'm more concerned about what it'll be like if we don't. Fair. Salvation. They found a way. To wait for them. But not for you. The others. To protect it. So now follow your way. Find the key. The past will tell. Just a second. Anything new from you, Rebecca? Oh, get off the wall, Desmond. No? Okay. How about you, Dad? You got anything for me? Nope. Okay. Going? Anything? No? Okay. Hello, Jenna. A new world approached. One that was dark and cold. It would consume us. For we were flesh, and flesh is frail. Though suits and shields might offer comfort, such adornments would not suffice. Not to save us all. So we sought to change what we were. In this manner, we might thrive in a world made poisonous. It was Aita who volunteered to see if it might be done. Aita, my husband, my love. In the end, it changed him, ruined him. He was made a prisoner of the machine. The body might survive, <coughs> but his mind became brittle to the touch. He begged me for release, for days, for weeks, for months. I pleaded with him to give us time to find another way. But, but there, there wasn't, wasn't one. one. Not, Not for, for him. him. Not, Not for us. And if you 
played future games and know about the sages, that was their origin. Okay, where did I come from? Where's the stairs? There's the stairs. Okay. Do I go over there? Pa probably. Or do I go up here? Potentially. Okay, that's the way out. Because that's down to the entrance area. Um, so then in that case... Oh, sorry, Desmond. I still haven't found the console. Because there's more here. Uh... <clears throat> How to get over there? Maybe just this, this, and this? And then will you just let me up? Climb up? Yes, you will just let me climb up. Okay. What is consciousness but a series of electrical impulses? And the body a vessel to hold these thoughts. But it is weak. In time, it decays and crumbles to dust. We asked ourselves then, what if it might be replaced with something stronger, something better? So we forged a new vessel, one that might endure. It proved easy enough to enter. what it required I don't recall anything in the future games that could be that this is where I came in and that's there okay Oop, don't fall Desmond all right all right Where did I come from? Where did I go? Oop. Careful, Desmond. Ah. Excuse me. Here we go. Yep, there's the console. Alright. Got anything more to show me, Juno? No? Alright. Okay, let's go check our email. It's been a bit. You got anything to say, Rebecca? No? Okay. Uh, okay, so we've read that. Read that. We've read up to 1030. Uh, 1031 balls. Uh... Seen it. Seen it.
children. Okay, so we've re we read those. Uh, we read that. Here's where Juno shows up, uh, starts emailing. Uh, more Juno. <laughs> she tells him to. To fuck up. She tells him to leave us alone, and Sean's just like, "Lol, somebody doesn't like me." Um. Okay, so I don't think we've read this one. Am I the only one, Rebecca, from Rebecca, am I the only one who thinks we should buy a couple, a few space heaters, maybe a couple of jackets too, it's cold down here. Sort of figured that as we power the place up, it'd turn on its climate control systems or something, guess not, maybe the first civvies like it this way. All I know is I don't, so I'd really like for us to pick up some sort of heating solution the next time we head out, please. Annoying from Sean. Uh, Abstergo is definitely on to us. Most of the power sources I, tr I was tracking are gone. Guess they're rushing to snap them up now that they know we're what we're up to. Uh, we've got the other cells scouting for us. Running interference, trying to grab anything they can. It's just hard with our numbers and their resources. That is from William Miles, from good old dad. Sean's continuing his search for additional power sources. I'm working to coordinate with the other cells, have them doing recon and watching for Abstergo. Rebecca's been monitoring your sessions. I'm hoping to duplicate some of the recordings and send them to other cells for further research. Also hoping there's a way to bypass some of these memories. But synchronization seems to dictate your, you progress in chronological order. Hopefully someday we'll have a way to move through memories more quickly. I would certainly, it would certainly save us a lot of time in situations like this. From Juno, hurry. Why do you delay? If you do not retrieve the key in time, all the world will perish and you with it. Yet you stop to talk or rest, rest later when your work is done. If I seem aggressive, if my words feel more imperative than, re than request, uh, it is because I fear that you will not succeed in time and then all of us are doomed. Also from Juno. Murderers! My father was taken from me by human hands. A war they called it for their freedom. They were not even meant to exist. You were not meant to exist. We conjured you a mistake. An error that cost us the world. My father would sing to me as a child soft songs of hope and love. His voice forever stilled when your brutish ancestors took up axe and club, later turned our own works against us. We might have known what was to come and averted it had you not dragged us into war. This is your fault. Juno is not a nice person. American politics from Sean. You know, it's rather incredible the way your lunatic fringe tries to conjure the spirit of the Founding Fathers to support their various causes. <clears throat> and by incredible, I mean hilarious. They hold up slave-owning sexist homophobes as if, they've, as if that's some sort of ideal which one should aspire. Oh, and in case you think I added that last bit for fun, as the sexism and slavery bits are already common knowledge, sodomy was a criminal offense in every one of the 13 colonies except for Georgia and Thomas Jefferson, champion of personal liberty that he was, advocated for the castration of homosexuals. 
Lovely fellows, these founding fathers of yours. Lovely fellows, these founding fathers of yours. And now that's uh, now there's that new bit of madness with people asking for the removal of textbook references to their slave owning. And before you think to turn it back around and rightly point out their barbarism was inspired by English law, last I checked, two stupids don't make us smart. I thought the whole point of the revolution was to break free of the old ways, and it certainly doesn't recommend your founders as the sort of persons one should aspire to become, unless you aspire to become a manipulative bigot. Lest you think I'm championing some sort of leftist agenda, I'll gladly shame the internet tough guys who celebrate the Treaty of Tripoli as well. Shame on them for thinking it shows anything other than something taken straight out of the First Grader's Guide to International Relations. Its intent wasn't to prove America wasn't a Christian nation. They were saying they weren't going to reignite the Crusades. No, that would be de no, that would be delayed for a couple of centuries. Now I don't believe your founding now I don't believe your founding fathers wanted to establish a theocracy, and they probably did intend for the country to be uh, welcoming of all religions, but this isn't proof of that. I suppose the point I'm trying to make is that people want uh, people might want to spend a little less time romanticizing and manipulating the past, fat chance of that, and a bit more time focusing on how to improve the future, fatter chance still. That's not to say there isn't plenty to be learned from looking back, because there is. It's just that most of those lessons wind up ignored or perverted these days. At best, it's disingen disingenuous and unproductive. At worst, and often, it's rather dangerous. Loud slurping noises. I love this game so much. All right, let's get back to Connor. Oh, look at that. I found a third power source already. It's popped up in an earlier search, but I've only just managed to confirm it. Where? There's a museum in Cairo with one on display. Guess Connor will have to wait. No, you stay. We need to find that key and time is running out. I'll make the trip. What about Cross? Everything's going to be fine. I'll be back soon. Ready when you are, Desmond. <laughs> Winter approaches. The air is still and sharp with grim expectation. The others sense it too and go about their work with uncommon urgency. I would like to help them, but more pressing matters now demand my attention. The Templars have targeted George Washington directly and will not rest until he is dead. I had hoped to shield him from this knowledge, but Thomas Hickey ended any hope I had of staying silent. And so I have resolved to share everything I know of the Templars and their plots, of who I really am. Achilles finds fault in this, and we argue every day, but there is simply too much now at stake to maintain restraint. Don't do this, Connor. Then what would you propose we do? Sit and watch while the Templars take control? We are sworn to stop them, or have you forgotten? Assassins are meant to be quiet, precise. We do not go announcing conspiracies from the rooftops to all who pass by. Who are you to lecture anyone? You locked yourself away in this crumbling heap and gave up on the Brotherhood entirely. Since the day I arrived, you've done nothing but discourage me. And on the rare occasions you've chosen to help, you've done so little, you may as well have done nothing at all. How dare you! Then tell me, on whose watch did the Brotherhood fall? Whose inaction allowed the Templar Order to grow so large that it now controls an entire nation? If I sought to dissuade you, it was because you knew nothing. If I was reluctant to contribute, it was because you were naive. A thousand times you would have died and taken God knows how many with you. Let me tell you something, Connor. Life is not a fairy tale, and there are no happy endings. No, not when men like you are left in charge. In your haste to save the world, boy, 
Take care you don't destroy. Mm. Ha! Knowing what we know what we learn in uh Assassin's Creed Rogue, which is two games after this one, and is about Achilles' past, those words come with heavy burden. Um I'm actually gonna take a brief break there. Um because I need to run to the bathroom. Um I say brief. I don't know how brief, but I'm going to take a break there. Uh, I will be back. Don't go anywhere, y'all.
I'm sorry. I've been talking this whole time, but my microphone was muted. I apologize, y'all. I was talking about how I how uh, I needed to do the New York running around and stuff like that, but I'm not going to do that on stream because it's a lot. Uh, I also was saying that uh, let's find some homestead missions, but I want to stop by the store here first. Pardon me, kids. Because I want to... I want to... I want to... I want to... I want to purchase some shit. All right. All righty then. All right. What you got for me, bruh? Got some new weapons here. All right. Officer sword purchased. Faster or better. The Washington's Battle Sword replica is the best one, if I remember correctly. Um, no exclamation marks there. Heavy weapons. Naval axe. I think this is the best, the more it's more balanced. I think it's better than the pirate boarding axe, but I still like the the actual sword. Um, firearms, double barrel pistol. How does it stack up to double barrel pistol flintlock features? A side by side barrel design. You have both barrels. It, having both barrels loaded lets you take two shots in a row. Okay, so I can fire without having to reload. I can fire twice without having to reload. That versus the English flintlock pistol. Uh, oops, I didn't mean to do that. Or the royal barrel. The the royal pistol has a long ass range, as you can see here. Um, and the English flintlock has is better at short range than this one, but I think I want the multiple shots. Now, uh, Scottish Flintlock. I like the rate of fire better. Oh, wait, the Royal Pistol has three shots, looks like. Hold on. No, that's got three shots. The normal one has three shots. What's the... Double barrel has nine. Is nine. In... Royal pistol has nine, too. Is the royal pistol double? It looks doubled, actually. As does the English flintlock, actually. Look at the royal pistol. How does that stack up to the double barrel? Long, it has a longer, better, longer range. Yeah, let's look at the royal pistol. Does that let me have more than one? Sorry, I gotta leave your shop. Alexander Hamilton. Yeah, no, this one's got two shots on it. Huh, how did I miss that? Well, it be like that sometimes. Mine hair would like. Mine, mine hair would like. Be combed. A trim, maybe? Okay, so firearms, I don't have anything new, anything else new, right? Right. Uh, consumables. Arrows. Oh. Stock up on a smoke bomb. Okay. Anything I can do here? No, not yet. Okay. Outfits. Uh, all right. Ooh, I like the New York outfit. The black and the red. Baltimore outfit. All right. So, Philadelphia outfit. How does that look again? Ooh, the more black. All right. I have to achieve full sync on the main story for that. 
have to complete all the homestead missions for that. Complete all the peg leg missions to obtain that. There's the captain of the Achilles uniform. The uniform he wore at the beginning of the game. Traditional clo colonial assassin outfit. That's from the DLC. Bayek, Shea, Jacob, Edward, Arno, Alexios, Aguilar. Yep. All right. So I think... I think... That this is the one I'm going to wear. Let's see what it looks like in, in the actual game. Let's get in the light. Oh, I love that. Okay. This is what we're, this is what we're, this is what we do it. Oh, okay. Do I have any missions here? Uh, I don't think so. I don't think so. Well, I do have. Oh, 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 oh. Uh, I do have a couple of chests that are now available. Uh, hold on, let me check my. I believe logbook is what I'm looking for. Collectibles. Yes, I am missing two chests, and they're both now available. So I'm gonna go ahead and go grab those. Break in my new outfit. Get and it's fine. Get out of that. Okay. Do -do 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 -do. Hey, Piggy. Pardon me, coming through. Oh, my, my bad, wrong button. Wait, why are you glowing? Ah, naval missions. Okay, I got some new ma naval missions here, too. <clears throat> Pardon me, coming through. All right. So probably what we'll do for more for the for the rest of the stream is we will. Uh, hold on. Let me let me let me up the game volume a little bit. There we go. That should be better. Um. Oh shit! I'm sorry. I pushed the wrong button. I didn't mean to. Oh fuck! I fucked up. I fucked up, 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 I fucked up. I fucked up, I fucked up, I fucked up. Ah! Nick, Nick, go through the door. Reload. Can I reload? Apparently not. Oh, I can't reload. It just it helps if I'm pushing the right button, doesn't it? All right. Hey, ma'am. Pardon me. Fine. I didn't. I didn't mean to. Fine. Yeah, don't make me, guys. All right. And down here. Oh, 
just a second. Okay, so I'm going to quick travel down here. Captain Kidd as I sailed, as I sailed. My name was Captain Kidd as I sailed. My name was Captain Kidd and God's law I did forbid. And so wickedly I did as I sailed, as I sailed. And wickedly I did as I sailed. bodies because I need some shot hey look I got some shot all right all right uh oh um need to clear my wanted level don't mind me fellas nothing to see here assassin's guild xp you gained yeah Let's actually look at this for a second. Uh, yeah, I know they're not available outside the city. I'm in the city. Fine. Okay, how about now? There we go. Bodyguard, marksman. Right. No longer wanted. Right. Okay. Homestead. Uh, because the homestead mission was down here, I'm going to fast travel to here. Because it's closer. Look at that outfit. I love that outfit so much. Ah. Uh, I mean, I pr personally, I prefer the original. Like, the the canon one but still the colors of this are are great oh my oh my name is captain kid as i sailed as i sailed name is captain kid as i sailed What's up, guys? Uh, have a minute, my friend? Of course. What's up? Is it coming, Big Dave? You make any progress on the knife? I would like to give it to Miriam soon. The steel Norris smelted is something else. I've rarely seen such fine metal. The trouble is my old tools aren't hard enough to work it. But the ones I need aren't hard to find. A shop or two in New York sell them at a good price. I'd do it myself, but with the regulars after my head, I'll Fair, stay here yeah. safe and sound if I can. I have matters to attend to in New York. I will see to it the next time I journey there. Sounds good. Okay. Anything else here? Nope. Uh, how about Boston? Got anything new here? We'll have to fast travel there in order to actually see anything. Nothing stands out. All right. 
to the frontier. Anything stand out as a mission other than the main one? Nope. All right. <clears throat> New York we go, guys. All right, let's teleport in here. Oh, my name is Captain Kid. As I sailed, as I sailed. All right. Homestead mission right there. Okay, we got a lot. We got a lot here. All right. Um... Ooh, that is a lot. Uh, let's let's focus. Let's do the homestead mission first. Uh, but there is an almanac page. I'm gonna do as much of the collectibles I can right now. Um, try to save us some time later. You know. Uh, I won't focus on them. Missions are my priority. But if I'm near them, I'm gonna go for them basically. And since I've not touched New York yet, they're kind of everywhere. No. There we go. <laughs> that laugh, though. All right. What do you need, my friend? What do you need, my friend? My friend. Uh, some submission items. Get both of these. Oh, are there any maps I need to get, actually? Probably. Nope, I have them all. Good, 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 good. Am I good on... Yeah. Okay. That's not the button I meant to push. I'm sorry, man. Let's come over here. I want to quickly check. Uh... Hold on, I'm forgetting something actually. Alright, let's stock up on the things. And we're in now in uh, things that I have to craft. So over to the crafting screen. All right. To level them up, which I'll work on in a second. I already have that unlocked. I already have that unlocked. Can't get that until I level them both up. I already have that unlocked. I have to level up Lance. That I'm already crafted, and I have to level up Ellen. Okay. And that out.
not trading. All right. Sorry, I just wanted to take care of that while I was thinking about it. Ooh, took care of most of my money there. All right. Captain's on a warpath, but oh wait. Deserter. What's his name? Big man or some such thing? Big Dave. Did in a whole unit escaping, they say. Dave's in for a rough ride, seems to me. Uh-oh. <clears throat> homestead mission here. In route to the homestead mission. Let's hit this viewpoint. I didn't mean to do that. I want the... Okay. Alright, let me get this chest because it's right here. Uh, there will be an ad starting in about eight minutes. I have merged with the bird. I am the bird. The bird, bird, bird. Ba 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 Okay. Alright, so I need to get up there. Um, this is kind of nearby. Just a second. Okay. Oh, careful, Connor. gotten uh oh, that's a peddler um i don't want to touch any of those liberation missions yet tavern over here uh courier mission sure oops we can at least go pick up the courier mission whether we do it or not yeet No. Down boy. <clears throat> boy. Hello. Thank you. Oh, must 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 be just complete. Uh. All right. I must have had what he needed on me. OK. 
Okay, best way to get over there is probably to come at it from this side. point over here I'll get that later I'm closer to this one ad starts in about four minutes don't mind me of treason and conspiracy oh. crimes punishable by death the sentence to be I'm out more I want this button before these witnesses they didn't do nothing please stop move along unless you want thank you thank you ever so much it's a just thing you've done I can't just let these fuckers kill them Stefan got injured. Leave them alone, Brick. gonna have to come in here fuckers don't mind me just looting my friends oh wait that wasn't my friend this is my friend I pick him up? Apparently not. I was interacting with him for a second. <coughs> yeah, whatever. Alright. We got an almanac page up here. <coughs> Excuse me for the coughing.
Yeah, yeah, yeah. My guys are currently not well. Um. Let me pull up my map here. Uh, nope, wrong thing. Legends, that's what I'm looking for. Uh, can I not? Wrong button. Yeah, can't narrow it down apparently. Yeet! Alright. Come on. That was a laugh. <laughs> Damn, dude. These men have been found guilty of treason. I didn't do nothing. Thank you. Thank you ever so much. This is just what you've done. All but two ciders, okay. I'm now closer to this viewpoint, so let's go ahead and grab it. Okay, Connor, show off. Come on, there you go. nearby get this chest
Deer marrow soup. Interesting. Let's go. Let's go check out this tavern here. Charm. Meat pies. Daffy's elixir. All right, you're a game. Game. friend you're my you're one of my assassin buddies good to see he's doing all right uh liberation mission assassination contract yeah let's, let's go kill somebody who in here want to start a riot Where is your leader? You'll never get to him. He's surrounded by twice as many men, twice as tough as this lot. Okay. Um, 
I need to get up this direction. Uh, these are the next closest, I believe. It's right behind it too. Shame. Bruh. Hey Phoenix, how you doing? Uh, I don't know why I called you Phoenix and not Rose. But how you doing, Rose? Um Tired, but good. Good, 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 good. Um I have I have to pee. I will be right back. I promise it's not because you're here. <laughs> I'll be right back. that y'all Even know his name. KG is the oh, cup. Rose. paranoid and suspicious of everyone and everything. Please. Once this guy's done talking. Me. Yes, Rose. Look what Katie got me. That Katie being cosplay Katie, of course. Of course. Who, you know, is right uh, in the bottom middle up at the top. Yeah, I know who you know, but for everybody else, anybody else. Ooh, tavern here. Biggie, 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 biggie. Conversations to be had. No, don't look like it. But how's your day been, Rose?
long. New York Morning Post. Sorry it's been a long day. But I'm glad you exist. Ow. Sorry, Connor, that was my bad. Oh, there's a ladder right here. You exist. That mindfuckery doesn't work on me. Because if you were just a figment of my imagination, things would be very different. <clears throat> Damn it, Connor. Lost it. Damn it. Oh well. Um. But yeah, if you didn't exist and you were just a figment of my imagination, you would be much, 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 much more fucked up than you actually are. And that would be true for anybody else that would be potentially a figment of my imagination. Hey, kid. Sorry, kid. Push your chest and a uh, viewpoint. Don't mind me, fella. Oh, don't mind me, fellas. Just gonna quickly. Oh, can't. Okay. Oh, shoot. Hi. The Lincoln Sword replica, nice. All right. Um. Ooh, there's an almanac page right here. Okay. I got that one. Okay. Go ahead and go here. For the sturdiest and most Kitty! Kitty! 
Okay. There's these two down here, but I'll get them later. <clears throat> ah, this is closer. Uh, this way. Hmm, let me go talk to this peddler over here. Because I need to buy more bullets. On my wayward side, there'll be peace when you are done. Lay your weary head to rest. Don't you cry no more. Okay. Uh, peg leg trinkets, because that's kind of important. me regulars it's all good Boston Brawlers mission there. Omenarch there. Let's go do the Boston Brawlers since it's right, there, right here. Alright, let me swap to... Another challenger about keep swinging. You hit me. Yes, several times, sir. Who's the smuggler in Boston? Alright, uh, do we want to liberate the fort? Fuck it, why not? But let's get this almanac page first. This blanket filth should have got a blanket about...
nope, fucked this up. Oh god, Connor, come on. No, it's gone. I'm not gonna get it. Time. Yep. Fuck me. Oh well. Alright, let's go free this fort up here. Why, fellas are all free now. Actually, 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 no. Uh, let's not free the fort until I've uh, completed the liberation missions. Uh, liberation contact. There we go. I was, look, I was looking for you. Corner. Not the button I meant to push. Connor. Oh, I'm so sorry, sir. Well, rip me. Rippity doo da, rippity a. My own, my eye. What a yeetful day. Dude's wearing a more traditional colonial assassin's outfit. I love it. All right. Sorry about the mess, dog. At least you're no beast like most of these people. Anybody who's immune has already fled. Cowards. And who are you? Jamie Colley. You need to keep doing what you're doing. Nobody else is. If we both get after it, we might be able to quell this monster of a disease. I will do what I can. I'll be lending a hand to these doctors. Find me once you think you've done enough, and maybe we can do more. Fair, that's fair, that's fair. Welcome, Yvonne. Welcome to New York! What are you talking to me for? You haven't done anything about the outbreak yet. Look at me wearing the New York outfit here. Hold on, let me get to a better spot to show off. Mister, can you help me? My father's real sick. He needs a healer. Can you carry him to one? You are a good man. The sickness just exploded out of nowhere. Sake that I survive it. How did you get it? I uh, don't know. Haven't talked to anybody with it. Um, we've not met him yet, but I have gotten the official uh, database entry in the in the game for uh, Alexander Hamilton. So I feel like we will be meeting him soon enough. Also, you missed, you missed it. You missed it. They had some very good conversations in the modern day about, about all this bullshit. Um, about the, like, this was stuff back in 2012, talking about things like, uh, uh, abusing uh, look whether or not we should uh, idolize these assholes who were our founding fathers because they were horrible horrible people who owned slaves uh and things like that like they had a whole ass thing about it and i, I like i'm 100 percent here for it 
Um, and you missed it. You missed it. But um, that's okay, because you can rewatch this this stream. Hair needed doing. I understand. Hi, Queen. Good to see you. Good to see you too. I hope both of your days have been going well. Both of yours being Queen and uh... Shh, don't bed dog. What, Connor? Connor? What? What is happening right now? That was so fucking weird. Ladies, I need you to move. It's been all right, Queen, that's good. Yeah, so basically I'm trying to keep a uh, plague under control and there's all kinds of uh, all kinds of things that I have to do that are keep helping keep it under control. I have to carry civilians to the doctor. I have to burn infected blankets and clo and clothing and stuff. And the dog, it's a it's a disease that that dogs carry and so you have to put down the dogs to keep them from uh, infecting others. Yeah, it's not good, but uh, it also prevents the doggies from suffering. Just drop this person on the fire here. No, uh, there you go, sir. Why are you saying that he's not at the doctor? He is at the doctor. What, did I not put him on the right bed? Doc. Eh, fuck it. I don't remember if I said this or not, Queen, but I'm glad you've been all right. There we go. That one counted. It's a start. Keep going and then talk real business. Um... How's my day been? My day's been pretty good. <clears throat> Stream has been going well, except for a few minor glitches that are just native to the game. But, um, been good. Come here.
Okay, so that's three six civilians. Just a second, y'all. Let me go, I beg you! Okay. <laughs> Sorry about that, y'all. Um, hopefully that wasn't too loud in the microphone. Ugh. Um... Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Queen. Um... Find this. It's fine, I didn't actually lose any health. Can I? Here we go. Climb, Connor. Let's go. Who's saying help me? Oh, I bet that's the homestead mission. Give me a second, Maria. I'll get to you in a second. I promise. I'm just gonna climb, come up here and just... Where is your mother? Follow me. Let me bugger off. Please. I guess help you me. want beating. I'm begging you to help me. Why won't you listen? I did. I smell a trap. Leave. That wasn't necessary. I can handle myself. When he returns, he'll try and give me twice the thrashing. Why would you stay with such a man? This is my house and business. It's my tailoring that paid for this place. I'll take his drunken buffoonery over leaving behind what I've built. If I told you there was another place where you could live and work, free of him, would you consider it? The catch? No catch. Our village is growing and in need of all forms of trade. Just business and a new life. I'll come and see if what you say is true. 
Not everything's a trap. She's a new f a new friend for our uh, growing homestead. Sorry, just refilling my cup. I don't know if you saw it or not, Queen, but look what my friend Cosplay Katie got me. Hashtag not sponsored by Starbucks. Yes, it's quite amazing. Some more bullets, please, and thank you. Okay. Okay. Now. Now. Um. <laughs> oh, too far out. I'm not seeing Jacob Zenger here, I don't think. Ah, it's because he's up here. Let's go talk to him. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm running over everybody right now. Jesus. So rude of me. Oh, peg leg trinket over here. Let's, uh... Go grab the trinket. I want the trinket. It's gone. I had it was completely invisible to me. Oh well. Mm, chest. These men have been found guilty of treason and conspiracy. Crimes punishable by death. The sentence is to be carried. No sad no no execution. It is just then you've done. No executions. Ouch. All right, let's go talk to Jake. seems to be controlling this area. Ja, martial law has been declared. For what purposes, I do not know. There is not a need. To do what I can is this hard. I may be able to help. Very well. I need information on the man responsible for this. He has men all over the place. Corrupt redcoats. Maybe we can get them to talk. Uh, maybe. Ah. Tides of change are coming in. Remain vigilant, and maybe we succeed in putting an end to this. Hold on, just a second, y'all.
believe this is my next. Nope, that's Jacob again. Jake, you want to talk more? Just a second, let me turn down the music just slightly. Nope, he doesn't want to talk, he's just telling me that he's here. <clears throat> Alright. Actually, let's take a break from this and. Ooh, a Benedict Arnold mission. Okay. Uh, but yeah, let's take a break from this and quick travel back to the homestead. Uh, well, actually, no, let's quick travel to Boston first. If only it was that easy. <clears throat> Could pop by and visit my friend Yvonne anytime I wanted. There's this, there's that. Go do this. Oh, wrong button. Or could pop over to visit my fr my other friends anytime I wanted. Just pop around, just... and then there. Bad thing. Find me coming through. Me. Hello, sir. I trust you're here for a tussle. Kick him while he's down. Now! Ooh. He, with that crunch, he's not getting back up. Hello, coward. up too. Oh no, I can't. Impressive. Very impressive. Okay, so I have 
have any other missions here? Note that I see. Alright, let's jump to the frontier. Wellity, wellity, wellity. There will be an ad starting in about five minutes and 45 seconds. Uh, I don't see anything else. Sorry, Connor. Just kind of broke your legs there, man. My bad. Hey fellas. Fight. Out to the rio. Back to Boston. Yep, back to Boston. To Boston. <clears throat> <laughs> how how did Fiona react, Queen, to my meowing? Looking for a tilt. Chuck. 
You're too predictable. Am I? Nothing out of the ordinary from you, eh? Nothing out of the ordinary from you, eh? Try something else next time. <laughs> Her ears perked up and she scurried away. Oh, Fiona. Alright, let's try that again. I think I know what I think I remember Looking what it was. For a to tilt. Do. Come on. Too easy. Ah, get fucked. All right, come here, bitch. All you do is hit. Too easy. Nothing out of the ordinary from you, eh? Nothing out of the ordinary from you, eh? See if I can remember how to do this. All you do is hit. Too easy. Oh, God. Let my health regenerate a little bit. Nothing out of the ordinary from you, eh? Just a second. I need to look this up because I don't want to. I don't want to desync again. No, I don't want YouTube.
Mm, okay. I thought I remembered correctly. It's just I w I'm apparently not getting my timing right. There we go. Come here, bitch. All you do is hit. Too easy. Nothing out of the order. There we right? go. Next. Ouch. All right, next is in New York, so I'll hold off on him. All right, Queen, take your time, no rush. Next is in New York, so we're gonna ignore that. Go up to the homestead. Uh, here. <laughs> All right. Nearest. Ooh, I've got several. Okay. Uh, Big Dave Smithy. Let's go there first. Big Dave. Let's go say hi to Big Dave. tools you requested ah excellent i'll get right to work norris has been hanging around pestering me about his knife <laughs> i thought you should know i overheard some regulars talking they are looking for you i imagine they are i'll have to face them sometime or another and i'll face them with you man don't worry about it level two All right. Hello. Hello, Ellen. Hello, Nelly. Day, Connor. I left some bolts of fine silk in my old home. They are very valuable, but I don't think it wise I return there. Someone might wind up dead. <laughs> I was I hoping her. you could retrieve them for me if you had time. Good old Nelly. Yeah, sure, I can do that. And, ooh, we got something up here at the inn, I believe. I believe that's the inn. I don't remember. Ooh, and we have uh, up here. Let's go to the inn first. Excuse me, might I impose upon the kindness in your heart to give bed and board to a weary traveler? Oh, traveler from where? Across an ocean, London. English! <laughs> Rest assured, I'm not the king's man. A great kindness. Bless you. We work hard for what we have here, old man. What is it you do exactly? I wish to provide God for those who seek his salvation. Not spoon-feed his word to those who already have their own. An outlook not shared by the monarchy. Lord knows some of us have things to confess. Ollie and I have been missing our Sunday Mass. I'd like Maria to read the Bible. 
I'm sure if we all pitched in, we could build a church. If you'd be our pastor. Connor? Welcome, Minister... Father. Father Timothy. Bless you. This will build a fine place of worship. I am most grateful. Let's head down here. Our homestead is filling out quite nicely, y'all. What's up? Con I don't mean to be a bother, but I wanted to ask you something. When my cars went up in flames, I lost most of my tools. I've got some spares back at my shop in Boston, but as you know, I'm not really welcome around there. I thought if it wasn't too much trouble, you could help me retrieve them? <coughs> sure. Going back to Boston soon enough. What would you have anyway. me do? Watch my back while I gather them. Meet me in Boston at my old shop. Okay. Oops, wrong button. Uh-oh. Prudence, what's up? Help! Somebody, please help me! What? Connor, what, what, what? Take the Lord! Prudence, are you alright? What are you Connor, doing out here in the woods? Thank goodness! The baby's coming! We need to get you to Dr. White. No! I can't move! Take my horse! Bring him here! Go! Dr. White, come with me. What's wrong? Prudence is in labor in the forest. God damn it, Connor, matter. get off the tree. <laughs> get on the horse, man. Are you gonna get on the horse? No? Okay, fine. Um, yes. We need to get water. Now? Yes. Yes, but also... Warren, Prudence was kind of insistent here? on doing her job with her husband and the farm, so... Over here. What's the trouble? Where is she? Tell me how she seemed to you. In great pain. She could not move herself. Was she pale? Was there blood? Not that I saw. Might be we have some time. 
We must hurry. Come on, slow asses. Hello, Doctor. I think I can manage at the moment. Is she all right, Doctor? No, she's not all right. She's having a baby, and here, by the looks of it. Yes. Looks to be in fine health as well. Has a good set of lungs on him. <laughs> no, I don't mean to rush you, but we need to get both you and... Does he have a name yet? Hunter. They are in the middle of nowhere, technically. <laughs> okay, and now we go up here. Uh, no, let's have that conversation here. I still teleported here, but... <laughs> yeah, even though this is a remastered game, they, they can only do so much. Smoke, Connor? No, thank you. We were just recalling the eventful day of Little Hunter's birth. I am Yesterday. not sure I have ever been so anxious. <laughs> 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 oh, oh. I barely remember a thing up until the moment I heard him cry. Then it all slows down, and I recall every little detail from Hunter's wailing face. To Prudence's teary eyes filled with pure love. To the smell of the mud and the leaves. And the placenta. I've never been as happy as I was in that instant. Ah, uh, things in this house sound right. Right? Obviously written by most likely men. Hello, Norris. What's up, buddy? Norris, what are you doing out here? I want to give Miriam a knife. Maybe you come with me? Of course. What is keeping you? I am nervous. I am certain she will love the blade you made for her. What am I doing? Giving a woman a knife as a gift? It's so stupid. This is something she will appreciate and use. Ugh. I made the stupid thing. I might as well give it to her. Dude, I love Norris so much. He's such a vibe.
right? A knife, especially one that's like custom crafted out of special steel. You know? Like, it's an incredibly thoughtful gift. Hello, Miriam. Hello, Norris. Hello, Connor. I'd love to stay and chat, but I promised Ellen a bale of furs this week, and I'm not even close to making good. I need to get out into the bush right away. Two hunters are better than one. I can help if you like. Would you? I'd be much obliged. I, uh, I bring something for you. Maybe, uh, it will help? I really must get moving. I will thank you properly when I get back. Until then... He got a kiss on the cheek! Meet me at my northernmost hunting blind after you take your first skin. Dude is in, though. Hey guys, what's up? Wrong button. Sorry, Connor. I wasn't paying attention. All right, let's go. Fucks. Let's go. One. Let's go. Come on. Come on, Wolfies. Let's go. No, no. Come on. Come on, fucker. Come on. It'll be Yum. fine. Yum. They have to treat it and and properly skin it and everything anyway. Fuck, poachers. Connor, need some backup. She's using that new knife. Connor, you out there? I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm coming. Could you use a little help here? On my way. Connor, need some backup. Bloody hell! Not him. <laughs> the time for forgiveness has passed. Please don't kill me. I'll never come back. That's literally the third time I'm you sorry. said that. You are I'm out of ch of chances. <coughs> I will come back again. I swear it. You bet you won't. I hadn't had this blade, that lick spittle might have gutted me. A time lick gift spittle. from Norris, it would seem. Indeed. I must make sure to thank him properly. Lick spittle. Lick spittle. That's an insult. All right, y'all, I got to pee, so I'll be right back, and then we'll push on towards the end of the stream.
Okay, I'm back. Let's go. All right, Yvonne, thanks for the lurk. We have a... Did we have a stop to make in the frontier? I don't remember. Let me look. Honor. Good to see you. <laughs> Been trying to avoid eye contact with my old neighbors. So far, so good. Not so worried now you're here. Oh. How are you doing otherwise? Oh, all right, I suppose. Things never really go as planned. But that's life. <coughs> really? How do you mean? You know, you make a plan, and it all goes awry, and nothing gets better, only slightly different. Sounds like you have had a string of misfortune. It will pass. <laughs> what are you doing here? Sweeping my steps, if it please you. Since when are these your steps? Since I bought them three weeks ago. From who? The owner, via his apprentice. Owner shipped off out of town, was it to you? I am the owner. Not anymore, mate. Sorry, better sort of things out with your apprentice. He's often at the pub over there, but I'm sure you already knew that. Patrick. Rip. Lance! Patrick! What <coughs> gave you the right to sell my shop? Well, you were run out of town. I thought you'd never come back, so I sold it all. The shop, the tools, it's rough luck. Anyway, Asshole. it's been great chatting, but I must be off. Have a nice life. I'm gonna kick his ass for money. What rot! Tools are a woodworker's lifeblood. He'd never sell them. I bet he's got them stashed somewhere. Then we follow him.
that kind of got fucked. How about we put the sword away, Connor? Bruh. Follow. It's went bad again. Lance, what am I gonna do with you? Dude can't won't even squat the fuck down to hide, man. Shit. Bruh, Lance, get out of eyesight, man. Go, Connor, go into the house. Fine, don't go into the house. Mechanical forging of all types. Specification. Price of meat now represented in America by Diana Soup. For the widest assortment of fry goods, feed, and other staples, call upon the I'll load these in the cart come nightfall and be in New York, free of this rubbish for good before the month is out. Well, that's something, at least. Thank you. I still can't believe he sold my shop. I'll see you back at the homestead. Yep. Yeah, no. Alright, no. 
Now, there was something in New York, if I remember correctly. Welcome back, Queen. Hey, thanks for the follow, Red Skull 713. Thank you, thank you. How are you doing? Red Skull. You seen the woman that worked here? She was my wife. Crawler, but my wife. A Bro. woman and her little girl. Have you seen them? Oh, no. Not you. I didn't want to pet the chickens, but I'm okay. Anything else here that I want to do real quick? Mm, not right now. Let's uh, head back to the homestead. Just down here, if I remember correctly. Let's uh, flip in here. <laughs> Frost is now look lurking. Fair enough. Fair enough. How's your day been? I found your bolts. Wonderful. Your day's been I good. It wasn't That's too much good. Trouble. Mine's been, mine's been pretty good too. Your husband was there, speaking ill of you. He ran off when he saw me. Oh my. That dirty, rotten bastard of a man would do something like that. At least you were able to come away with the only thing of value that remained there. Thank you, Connor. Roll Nelly can now craft level two goods. Score. Do we have any more missions at the moment? <clears throat> Nothing visible here at least. Let's uh well okay, let's actually let it let it settle a second. <laughs> let it register that the mission has been completed. Alright, now. Hey, look, there is one. I 
as a general heads up, there is about half, uh, less than half an hour left of the stream, uh, more or less. Connor. Connor. What's up, y'all? Connor. Ellen's dullard of a man is trying to break down her door with his. Ha <laughs> ha. We're on our way to stop it. Every badass in this town going to her dis her aid. I'm here for it. She's not your daughter anymore, you Slammed him into into the door. <laughs> Get fucked. Hey, let's just you know, hug it out. Hug it out. Hug it out. Come out here and get what is. You'll regret nope. this. Also, no. And still no. Oh, in the face! Ooh. Ellen and Maria are free of you. I say so. The people behind me say so. Believe me when I tell you, if I ever see you on this land again, I will end you. You can have them. Thank you. All of you. Nobody has ever stood up for us before. We protect our own, Ellen. This is my home now. I'll find a way to show my gratitude to you all. I promise. Look at him limping off in the background. <laughs> Assholes can get fucked. Yet another homestead mission. All right. Gonna quick travel up here. Hey, Miriam. What's up? Ooh, wedding! Geeky! My friend! Norris, what are you doing? <laughs> I love Norris so much! Comes running at Connor from the back all excited! Gets flipped <laughs> onto his back and his first response is to grin and say, My friend! <laughs> she said yes! Marion, we are getting married. I told you not to touch him, Norris. Is it true? <laughs> yes. <laughs> so now that you've been told, might I have a word? We have much work to do. Of course, what would you have me do? Accompany me to the inn. I have business there. <coughs> Norris is a stickler when it comes to tradition. Marion knows not where her father is. And they were hopeful that you might act his part at the ceremony. I am not familiar with colonial wedding customs. It means you will walk with her during the ceremony and give her to Norris as her father would. I would be honored. Wonderful. On to other business. Our weddings are complex beasts and require many hands working together to execute. We'll need Warren and Prudence to provide food, Ellen to make them appropriate clothes, Big Dave to smith wedding bands, me to conduct the service, and Oliver and Corinne to host a banquet. That is a lot. We'll start here. Connor's gonna be given away to bride. Oh, They were, they were hoping, they were hoping he'd give away the bride. 
I wish I'd had. I wish it would let me uh, change my clothing. How to go back to the Animus after finishing the main story? I mean, the DNA tracker is the primary thing. Thank you for the follow, um, the pain 26. Um, but yeah, generally when you're in the thing, you go into the main menu and then your DNA tracker will let you go back through and reload missions and stuff. Like this one, I I didn't 100%, so I could go back. I'm currently in a thing, so it says replay not available, but, you know. Thank you for the follow. Uh, I'll talk to you in a second, Norris. I need to go downstairs, if it'll let me. Please let me? Yes. Okay. Let me change clothes. Which outfit is good for a wedding? Let's see here. This one is really nice. Pretty nice. Ooh, I, I like that one. Kind of feels wedding-y. Jamestown kind of feels wedding-y. I wish several of my female friends were here. I think, uh, Queen, are you still in the Discord? To get to plot points in the game? I'm not 100% sure what you're, uh, asking, uh, the pain. Um, but Queen, yes, good, you're still in the Discord, good. Okay, so, <clears throat> I'm going to go through these outfits that I currently have unlocked. Which one would you say would be best for a wedding? So there's this one, which is what I'm currently wearing with the black and the red and the white. This one. The Baltimore outfit. The Boston outfit. The Jamestown outfit. I kind of like this one. This one kind of feels a little formal to me. The Jamestown one does. Which I feel like, I feel a little, you know. Jamestown, maybe, yeah. Philadelphia outfit. Um, eh, I mean, maybe. I like how white the shirt is. It looks clean. Um, the Charleston outfit. Blue coat. Etc. The contract with the contrast with the black, uh, the ba the default assassin outfit, which is the canon one and all of that. And then I go into the ones from other games like uh, Ezio's um, Alta Ears, which I don't have unlocked yet. Um, the prisoner outfit, which is the it, probably not no. <laughs> um, I don't have that unlocked. I don't have that unlocked. Technically, because I am the captain of a ship, technically speaking, you know, this would be formal wear. Um, I could also go in my native clothing. Exactly, since I'm a uh, since it's a wedding and I'm a captain. I almost said since I'm a wedding and it's a captain. Uh, but yeah, traditional native clothing. And then here's the traditional colonial assassin outfits. Red Skull likes the Charleston or the Jamestown for a wedding. Um, and then here's Bayek, Shay, Jacob. Also, for, I'm kind of wanting to stay away from ones from other character from other games because they're not canonical, you know? Um... So yeah, do we want to, do we kind of go with the captain one because it's a wedding and he is a captain of a ship, even though the wedding is not happening on the ship? Queen votes for the Philadelphia outfit. 
Oh, yes to the captain? Captain or Philadelphia? Uh, Red Skull says Charleston or Jamestown for a wedding. Hmm. I like the Philadelphia one for a wedding because it kind of feels the traditional tux like because it's got the black jacket, the white shirt, you know, um, and the black pants. It kind of feels suit like or tux like. Um, hold on just a second. Let me. And the red belt as a nice. Uh, where'd it go? There it is. As a nice. Uh, um accent yeah um let's let's look on it let's look at it actually on connor let's look at it actually on connor let's get some good lighting He's got a little bit of white coattails that you didn't that you can't that you don't see in the thing. It look it looks a little bit more charcoal than it did it does in the actual in the in the preview. Um which is fine cuz that works for a suit. Red Skull votes for the Philadelphia one. Um let's pull out the captain one. Uh, because again, technically captain of a ship, so you know. The good old traditional tricorn hat. It does feel formal. It does feel formal. And it fits the era. And it is his position as captain of a ship. Ooh, I like how the how the coat flares out when he turns. That's some Seto Kaiba coat flareage right there. And let, uh, let's pull out the Charleston and Jamestown for good measure, though. Uh, Jamestown. The flare is absolutely necessary, says the queen. Uh, if he's walking the bride down the aisle, he needs to be dressed to the nines. Absolutely. Absolutely. So here's the Jamestown one. I feel like there's a lot going on with this one. Now that you actually see it on him, like it, I like the color scheme and all that, but there's a lot going on with this one. Yeah, I like the red accents and the blue shirt, but there's a lot going on with this one. So I'm kind of thinking, I'm kind of thinking no for a wedding. Um, uh, Charleston was the other one. Load in. All right, here's here's the here's the other one. I'm trying to get centered in the light. There we go. I like the blue. It is a nice blue jacket and pants combo. Um. Doesn't feel quite formal enough to be walking the bride of uh, the bride down the the aisle. Yeah, exactly. Not formal enough, Queen. Sorry, Red Skull. Um, but uh, so we're down to Philadelphia or the or the captain. Once more, the Philadelphia. Ooh. 
and the captain. Yeah. I'm kind of feeling the captain. I'm kind of feeling the captain one, honestly. Uh, now, there is one more I want to pull up and look at, just because I have not actually looked at it yet. At all. Let's see what this looks like. Let's go with the captain one. I feel like the captain is I, I feel like the captain outfit is it. Um Yeah, this feels right. This feels right. All right, Norris, what you got? What's up, Norris? Nerves? Connor, everything seems to be in order for the big day. It is. Except uh, I can't find Miriam. Uh, I'm certain she's making sure all is perfect. I will find her, my friend. Especially since I have to walk her down the aisle. Search for clues to Miriam's whereabouts. I bet she's out hunting. Oh. Nope, she was in the house, apparently. But I bet she's out hunting. Miriam's flowers. Just left on the floor. Mirror. Yeah, she decided to go for, uh, go, go out. She, I, I feel like her nerves hit her. <clears throat> I feel like nerves hit her and she's kind of panicking a little bit. And so she's used to, and since she's used to the more simplistic life, that's where she went. That's what I feel like. But I guess we'll find out. For leading someone down the aisle, that seems right. She don't want to marry you, dumbass. Oh, wrong way. This way. There we go. Yeah, I bet she went out hunting. In her wedding dress. Talk about cold feet in the snow, man. Why do you run? Leave me be. I'm no housewife. Nobody thinks you are one. Look at the, uh, the look at the absolute parkour she's doing in her wedding dress, though. Oh, look at him all spiffied up. Yeah, the captain's outfit was a good choice. It was a very good choice. You may kiss your bride.
So basically she had nerves because she heard, they kind of skipped it a little bit because I caught up with her too quickly, but uh, she had nerves because uh, she overheard Norris saying some stuff about traditional wife bullshit. And she went, I'm nobody's housewife. And freaked the fuck out. And, yeah. Anyway. Hello, Connor. Enjoying yourself? I am. It is nice to see everyone together and happy. Look at those two kids. It's a lovely sight. Norris is one of my best friends, and he couldn't have found a better woman. Proud of him. Sometimes people are just right for one another. Norris and Miriam are a match made in heaven. Or a match made by Connor. Isn't that right? I only help Norris muster his courage. The rest came naturally. Aww. <laughs> and my little brother Joseph... Tossed him in the river! <laughs> <laughs> Connor, we were just recalling our weddings. Spirited events, I take it. <laughs> Spirited? <laughs> More like brawls than unions they were. <laughs> calling Joe Little is like calling me Big Terry. Oh, he's a bloody mountain. My younger brother had a blow up with one of Terry's cousins. A minor disagreement about some lass's dance card. I'll just say Terry's cousin sobered up right quick when it was over. Poor boy. Sitting there sopping wet on a stump while Joseph spun around with the object of his affection. <laughs> it was good for him. Thought him good things don't come easy. Excuse me, everyone. Thank you. I won't keep you long. I would like to present something to Connor and you all. I once said I'd find a way to show my gratitude for your courageous actions in my defense. And this is what I give you today. This flag is a symbol of our strength and unity. And I would hope you'd all be proud to fly it high above your homes and shops. I'll happily make one for each and every one of you, if you so desire. But this one is for you, Connor. Aww. Thank you. Aww. All right, and that's actually a very good place to call it for the night. Um, it's a very good place to call it for the night. I mean, we let it. Yeah, we still have a couple. We have still several more homestead missions, but that's a no, not a 24 hour stream. I don't think I could handle it right now. Um, but, uh, yeah. Uh, thanks for stopping by, y'all. Um, thank you for the follows for uh, you, you uh, relatively new folks or even brand new folks. Um, tomorrow I'll be playing Tomb Raider uh, from... 2 p.m. Cent U.S. Central Time till about now um, is when that will be. Um, I'll be continuing Tomb Raider 3. I'm getting close to the end of that one, actually. Um, and uh, then Wednesday will be Mirror's Edge, and Thursday will be Shadow of Mordor. All at the same time. Uh, same time slot, I mean. Uh, check out my social medias here. Um, you got these, uh, follow these amazing people up here. Check out my social medias down in my link tree. Excuse me. Uh, uh, 
social medias in the link tree as well as more recommendations for people you can follow uh there is uh, a link to my discord in there if you're not already part of there um and um yeah check out these amazing people and like i said there's even more recommendations in the link tree remember to have empathy be kind be safe love yourself and love everyone around you and i will see you all tomorrow i love you all thanks for hanging out peace out